Hello everyone, in this video we will learn how to calculate the percentage of burns and how to resuscitate a patient with burns. Now the most common way of calculating the percentage of burns is by using the Wallace rule of 9. See how I have written this W. So draw a W over this figure similarly like this and draw a line dividing it in half and write 9 next to each straight line like this. Okay. So you can see the upper limb has one straight line that means the entire upper limb is 9% whereas the lower limb has two straight lines that means it is 18%. 9% for front of lower limb, 9% for back of lower limb whereas the chest and torso has four lines. So give it two to the chest, two to the abdomen that means 9% for the front of chest, 9% for the upper back, 9% for the front of the abdomen, 9% for the back of the abdomen and 9% to the head and 1% to the external genitalia. Now this is the most common way of calculating burns but the best way is by using the Lund and Broder chart. So remember the mnemonic Broder's is best for burns. Now how do we resuscitate these patients? First you need to know whether it's a regular burn or whether it's an electrical burn. For regular burn you're going to use the formula 2 into kg body weight into percentage of the body surface area burnt. Whereas for electrical injury, you need to double it. Then it becomes 4 into kg of the body weight and percentage of the body surface area burnt. Now, whatever you're going to get is for 24 hours and half of it should be given in the first 8 hours and the other half in the next 16 hours. Thank you. 